Chris, congratulations. You won the SEC Defensive Player of the Week. Your first time to win that honor. What does it feel like to have that honor? Uh, it, it feels awesome. You know, I just go out there and try to play my best every game and uh, just try to get to the ball. You know, not really worried about all the stats and stuff. Just just playing to win the football game and whatever comes after that just comes. There's no question you've been on a hot streak lately. You have back to back double digit tackle games. What are you doing to just make sure that momentum doesn't stop and you can just keep getting in on every play? Uh, just just fly around, you know, just, tr just try to go out there and have fun. When you go out there and think too much and uh, just, you know, worry about everything else, you, you really can't, you know, get into the feel of the game. It's kind of like playing quarterback. If if you get in the flow of things, you know, the, the quarterback's probably going to have a pretty big game. It's kind of the same thing for linebacker. Whenever you start, you know, making plays, it just seems like they just keep coming. Obviously, Florida was a big win. You're one four straight now. You're top 25. What are you doing to make sure you don't overlook this non-conference opponent in UAB? Well, they're they're a pretty good football team. There's no doubt about it. They uh they won some pretty big games. They they almost beat Tennessee, and Tennessee's an SEC team. That's a you know that they're they're a very good football team. So there's no doubt we're not going to look over them. We got to come and ready to play and uh try to get a big time win. All right, Chris, appreciate it.